And now, for something completely different. It's... <laughs> um, autobiography um, of Kevin Peterson. Mm -hmm. He talked um, a lot, and I know you were on the Grand Norton show with him, and he was complaining about um, the dressing room. Mm. And I, I wonder if um, any of that sort of, uh, happened at all in, in your dressing room. Not on the sports field, but um, in, in the comedy. No, uh, the interesting thing is how harmonious the groups were that I worked with. I mean, you couldn't work with nicer people than Barker and Corbett. They were just lovely. And the producer, Jimmy Gilbert, was lovely. Uh, no, Nobody, not a hint of trouble or an argument. Same on the 48 show. I remember very, very few disagreements on the 48 show. When we got to Python, Terry Jones and I butted heads a lot because we were temperamentally very different. And I found him very unyielding on everything, and I'm sure he thought the same of me. But otherwise, no, pretty friendly. Um, and then I moved on to other things like the uh, video arts where we made management sales training films all those years. Uh, I, remarkably harmonious for 20 years. Um, the same on, on uh, Fish Called Wanda, the same on Faulty Towers. Uh, I've met remarkably few difficult or unpleasant people in the 50 years I've been in show business. I think I met one actor who was very arrogant when he was making a video arts uh, training film and uh, one actress I worked with in a movie once. Uh, I didn't have a very big part in it and I found her strangely difficult. And one actress in a television series in America once that I really didn't like. And I think in 50 years those are the only three I can think of. <laughs>